Hello, guys and gals, and this is part or week 37 of our weekly writing challenge. And as always, we're going to go over the um, previous stuff. Um, okay. Again, there's a playlist somewhere that has all of these, if you're curious about any specific one. Anyways, the writing challenge for week one was create a setting, be as detailed or vague as you like. Week two was create two characters, be as detailed or vague as you like. Writing challenge for week three was create one final character, either a hero or a villain, be as detailed or vague as you like. Week four was create a time period, any time period will do, any technology level will do, be as detailed or vague as you like. Writing challenge for week five is create one interaction between two characters. It doesn't need to be canon to the story. And we did that. Week six was create a climate or weather situation, i.e. a sandstorm, snowstorm, rainstorm, etc. Week seven was look out one of your windows and describe what you see. Week eight was describe your favorite food. Week nine was describe your favorite mythical or fantastic creature. Week ten was describe your favorite dinosaur. Week eleven was describe your ideal vacation. Week 12 was describe your favorite season. Week 13 was describe your favorite beverage. Week 14, describe your favorite non-fantastic animal. Week 15 was if you could visit any country, which one would you visit? Week 16 was our 50 subscriber special, and that's describe something you are thankful for. Writing challenge for week 17 was describe one of your hobbies. Week 18 was describe one of your New Year's resolutions. Writing challenge for week 19 was describe your dream job. Writing challenge for week 20 was describe your favorite genre of video game. Week 21 was if you had a magical toolbox that would always have one tool inside it, it would never be lost. Which tool would it be? Week 22 was if you could have one superpower, what would it be? Writing challenge for week thir- 23, rather, is describe your favorite holiday. Week 24 was describe your favorite superhero. Week 25 was if you could open a restaurant, what would you sell? Week 26, if you could form a band, what kind of music would you play? Week 27 is if you could write an epic story, what would it be about? Week 28 is if you could change one event in the past, would you? Uh, and uh, this, the pictures here go with this one. If you could design a logo that would represent your life, what would it look like? I wrote it on the wrong page. Writing challenge for week 30 was, if you could build your dream house, what would you build? Writing challenge for week 31, if you could tame any animal, either normal or fantastic, which would you tame? Writing challenge for week 32, I was between pens at the time. If you could learn any language and speak it fluently, which language would you learn? Writing uh, the 75 subscriber special, week 33, if you could meet one historical figure, who would it be and why? Week 34 was, if you could manipulate DNA and create a perfect fruit, what flavors would you combine? Writing challenge for week 35 was if you could transform into any animal, which animal would it be? And we are to our newest or last week's challenge. And the one that we have to do right now. It is if you could start an animal rescue program, which animals would you rescue and why? And I got this inspiration from, um, I think it was Save a Fox or something. That would be... I could generically say, uh, use a blanket term like, say, all animals, because, um, well, it's good to, to help animals, um, especially um, animals that were meant to be wild animals, but were domesticated and really wouldn't be able to return to the wild. Um, but that's kind of a blanket term, and um, I would probably say any and all, but... I would probably specialize with horses, I would say. If I had to pick one. But I would probably try and help all animals that I had room for. 
if I had like a huge compound or something, you know, um, given the limited space that I'm at now, it wouldn't be suitable as a, um, sh uh, a rescue shelter. But if I had the space, um, I would probably say horses or any and all. Now it's time to reveal our writing challenge for this week. This week's writing challenge is describe an ideal setting for a scary story. Okay. There are lots of opportunities for this. I mean, lots of possibilities. Um, so, yeah. So, we are off to a good start here. Describe an ideal setting for a scary story. We're going to talk about horror then. Horror stories. Um, but yeah, I will give this one more time and then we will have the outro. The writing challenge for week 37 is describe an ideal setting for a scary story. And that's that. Describe an ideal setting for a scary story. And that is going to do it for this video. Um, if you like this content, then make sure you like and subscribe and ring the bell so you know when I upload. Also, if you want to support me in any way, or if you want to join this the Discord server, then all that information will be in the description below. And thanks for watching, everyone. And have a great day.